Eight days ago on Thursday afternoon, I was alerted that uh, Aurora police officers had taken a photo at the memorial site of Elijah McLean. Not only that did they take the photo with smiles in their faces, they reenacted a carotid control hold, which is what was administered on Elijah that night. Uh, this picture was taken on October 20th of 2019. I am disgusted to my core, and I immediately uh, ordered an internal affairs inv investigation, and I promised that I would expedite that investigation, as is my right as the chief of police. It is important to understand, uh, after I had ordered the investigation, I made sure that each officer was ordered in that evening and that those, those interviews were done that evening. I had placed them all on administrative leave with pay immediately, and I want everyone across the country to know um, that it, by city charter, I can only place officers on administrative leave without pay if they're charged with a felony. So that is why they were placed with pay. I know that everyone, this uh, story uh, came out on Monday night. Um, I had our legal advisor reach out to um, Shanine McLean's lawyer and told her that I would like to sit down and make sure that she has all the information. No one has the right to see these these pictures before she sees these pictures. This is her son. This is her son being mocked. One officer, as you all are aware, uh, resigned Tuesday morning, and I want to tell him I appreciate you doing the right thing. I appreciate you realizing what you have done and what a despicable act and what you have brought upon this nation, upon this family, and you have embarrassed law enforcement yet again. And I terminated the remaining three. I was not the chief of police during the original incident. Um, I can only deal with this incident, and I'm not saying that they, that is being investigated by four other agencies now, the FBI, the DOJ, the independent investigation that the city um, called for, um, as well as uh, the governor asking um, Attorney General uh, Phil Weiser to look into this case.